history is back tonight. The former two division champion, Conor McGregor, as such, the celebs are out. Let's see what type of version of Conor McGregor shows up here tonight. Usually when Conor McGregor shows up, it's usually his best right. version. He's a guy that takes a great amount of pride in preparing for the event. He says it's a fight every single time he sees his opponent, from the press conference to the weigh-ins to the stare down. He is ready to show his opponent his best self every time he's in their face. And not only does he do that in the buildup when he gets into the octagon, with all the ability that he possesses, he's able to do that same thing. That's why he's been so successful and has gone from the top, from the bottom, to the top of the UFC in such a short time. Truly one of the elite strikers in UFC history. Moves every needle you would like him to move. And as you said, his work ethic, his preparation truly is legendary. Let's see if he has put in the right work in advance of this showcase fight here tonight. can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Chief. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. McGregor is one year the elder. He will have a two-inch reach advantage. The veteran voice Ladies of the octagon, Bruce Buff. This is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. And it's time! Five rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 22 wins, six losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch him up and we are underway. Jab now, just snapping that thing off, DC. I believe that the jab was 
lost in mixed martial arts initially. But now it has been found, and it's been found by this young man in this octagon tonight. And that one certainly found the target. Now we get back to range. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. Yeah, it looks a little wobbly on his feet. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! Oh, nice. Well, Gregor's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Just misses there with the left. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish the fight. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Whoa! Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh! Oh! And he lands a big left hand there. Oh, spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Holy smokes! Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest. A two minutes, 24 seconds in the very first round. Declare the winner. Oh, oh.